I do apologize, I'm slightly distracted at the moment, and we are slightly behind as usual. How about that? Um, oh my god, yeah, I know, right? Um, well, I'm trying to get Facebook running again. We're going to give them a shot, and if they last, great. If they don't, we'll boot them out again. Um, there we go. Um, so... If this thing wakes the frick up, there we go. And our fa Facebook friends are now with us. So on that note, welcome back. We uh, we got through day seven. Uh, yeah, um, it is fairly obvious to us that we are going to need more ammo. We are going to oh, need... Oh, you will. I won't. He, yeah, he's just going to stand there and punch shit. Uh, we're also going to need to make a peak hole for me to be able to shoot over his shoulder. Um, <clears throat> uh, we can't do a peak hole over my shoulder. Yeah, we can. Yeah, we can. Uh, yeah, so we'll figure it out. You know, obviously, oh, you know what? Screw it. Here's the deal. Uh, we're going to listen to Orphic Night while I get loaded into this fucking game. So, yeah, we'll see you right after Orphic Night by never, whoever the frick these people are. That was Orphic Night. I don't know what the freaking hell that's supposed to mean. I'm sorry, just not that. I mean, I'm, I'm not a severely intelligent person, I guess. I don't know. Orphic Night. I don't know what that no. means. I don't know. That makes no sense to me. I don't know. I just, that's the name of the damn thing, so F it. It's an Orphic Night. I don't know. I, you know, I kind of want to look it up, and I kind of don't. <laughs> it's just kind of... It was kind of like it's kind of like they they said, hey, you know what? We have no idea what to call this song, so we're just gonna call it Orphic Night, and then we're just gonna rhyme night. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Be 
did. That's, that's awful. Yeah, well, it's, you know, it's lame. Whatever, what do you want? It's NCS releases, you know. They're going to do what they're going to do. Um... So in news today, uh, Trump says he's been charged in a Mar-a-Lago classified documents investigation. Cool. I have no clue what that means. Don't think I'd care. Um, let's see. Oh, it sounds like I'm into the game. I'm sorry. Just reading. Yep, I'm in the game. Reloaded. Zombie bear after me. A zombie bear? Where? I don't know. I'm in the city. Oh, okay. That's terrifying. Here we go. I don't have a gun either. Oh, sick. A spear. And maybe I can throw it at the fucking. Let's see if my. Uh... Oh, why did I lag? Okay. Alright, let's see if I can do a well aimed shot. Apparently I'm thirsty. Oh yeah, right at the bear. Shit. Shit, breaking through that. Alright, I'm gonna see if I can find um... Oh, okay, okay. Okay, I can make one. And it takes 10 seconds. What are you trying to make? I'm in a Molotov. I should get out of it. Okay. It's on fire. How do you like being on fire, buddy? I don't feel too good, Doc. Oh, shit. I'm thinking he didn't like that. <laughs> oh, he's still on fire though, which is a good time. Yeah, of course. That's always a good time when oh, we're on fire. Oh, he's not on fire anymore. Wait. Oh my god. Shit. I don't even know what to do. Well, I don't know a single thing that can kill this guy. I think I have something to kill him. Oh, wait. Make a. Uh... Are you running away from him? No, oh, I'm looking at him right now. Is this your bicycle? Nope. Oh well, yeah, yeah it is. I do have a gun with bolts in it. I do, why? Yeah, I need you to shoot at him. A lot. Okay, you actually want to kill him. Oh my god. I think he's down. Then it sounds like there are some screamers after me here. Wow, shoes. Tuna. Smoothie. Oh, I remember the yucky juice. Most important thing in the game. Hmm. Shit. Fuck out of here. Did you find another screamer? He's dead. Yeah, I didn't realize he killed the bear when I did, so I just kept shooting him. <laughs> How do you scrap the cars? You have to have a wrench. Hmm. An iron sledgehammer. I may need to get one of them. Huh? I may need to get one of them. An iron sledgehammer? Or a wrench? Wrench. Folks going down. Yeah. Done. Bam. Shit. What? Fucking thing just collapsed on me. What the? Fucking floor. Oh.
don't know how the hell to get out of here, man. Um, uh, I don't know. Me neither. Looks like you might have been in here. It says drop loot bag. Okay, I'm getting out of here. Out of where? I don't know, this fucking... Whole building? Building that I got trapped in. Why is my FPS so low? I don't know. 60 frames per second. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, now it's better. Like, exit out of Discord, kind of. Oh, yeah, close the Discord? Yeah. Yeah, I should probably do the same. That will help with mine, too. So, yeah, inside this gun case, I have rocket launcher parts, trigger group semi mod, mm -hmm. um, an ergonomic grip mod, and steel arrowheads. Steel arrowheads are nice. I don't use a bow. Yeah, I'm just gonna take it all. Do you have a lockpick? Yeah. Well, there's lockpick full things in here. Oh, where are you? I don't really know how to say where I am. Oh. I am. Well, I'll tell you what. Give me a minute, and I will come find you. Because currently, I am. Uh, I am trying to swap out some of my weapons. All right. Now I have a pistol. I have an AK-47 and a rifle. No pipe guns for me. Oh, good. Correction, no, I do have a, um, I, I do have a, um, pipe rifle, my bad. All right. So far, so good. And that is definitely a locked door. Let's see if I can find my way out of here. there and now I need to find my bicycle. I also need to find a drink apparently because I'm thirsty. All right so you are where you are now is lock pickable things or no? Yes. Okay. Are you in that house? You're on the second floor. Let me see if I can figure out how to get in here. I'm gonna find your bike. Oh wait, the front door's open. I, I didn't open that one. I wish you could mark things. Yeah. I don't know how. <laughs> no, that's an island, dude. Okay, my foot's here. On the second floor? Yeah. Okay. Oh wow, there's a basement. Did you go in the basement yet? Michael, Michael. No, I already went in the basement. That's why I got stuck. Oh, was there nothing in the basement? Nothing in the basement. Oh, okay. What's up? Upstairs, come on. This room. <laughs> you didn't like that picture? Okay, would you just jump out the window? Um, yeah, I can. Okay, we, we, but you just leaving? Yeah, yeah, I can have to do it. That's just on the there. Ah. 
There's Zom. No. I need to make lockpicks now because I'm friggin' out. Did you read that book, by the way? Nettle, needle and Thread? Yes. Okay. How do I make lockpicks? You know what pass is, by the way. That's good. Um, crafting. Forged iron and mechanical parts. Really? It's stupid. Yeah. They could at least make it make sense. I am literally like, I am almost there with this lockpick, but oh, I why is my broke game it. stuttering so bad? That's what I usually have the problem with. Okay, this is actually so ass. Ever since it turned off one of the things in the video, let me turn it back on and see if that improves. I'm level 3 with lockpicking. Why am I having a hard time with this shit? Lockpicking is stupid in this game. Apparently. Okay. So now I'm getting 51 FPS. Michael, can I restart this? Fucking. Because. This is stupid. 48 FPS. Michael, I'm gonna restart. Give me a minute. I need to go get my bicycle. You can go anywhere. Yeah, but if I get warped away, then it does go somewhere. So let me pick it up and then go ahead and do that. Um, all right. I now have it. Ah, oh, you've been booted from the server. Let's restart the entire game. Woohoo. Hmm. Oh, you know, the whole time my camera's been off, but you know what's really funny is I'm going to keep my camera off because I'm going to go grab something to eat while you're reloading. <sighs> okay. I will be right back. so bad is because glass is an entity and not a block in this game. Guys, one more trip. I'm getting 66 frames. Let's get close, guys. Let's go. Let's go. It's definitely because I'm near that hospital, though. cars in this game feel like destroyed right so they turn into like pancakes in the driveway for some reason i don't know why maybe the apocalypse like zombies have like pounding machines they just smush their cars together for whatever reason it, it makes no sense to me but yeah, so Gotta make it make sense. If you didn't already know, salvage operations is super good. Getting, not a good loot, like, level 6 battery. Uh, I 
changing so let's So these cars will probably reset soon. I've got no idea, um, idea if they actually will or when. All right, after I sold her everything that I got, um, I got 680, 6,845, which is uh, kind of good. So with that, I can buy really nothing. Oh, I can buy an armor table pocket mod. That'd be sick. Breaker. I 
Dude, it's brain turd A. Okay, we are backish. Hey, I guess who's backish? Yeah. Oh, now my friends were, were all fucked up. Okay. That's not good. I'm just kidding. Um, where is my bicycle? Nope. I just threw it on the ground because I'm being stupid. I forgot I had to actually put it in my inventory and then use it for my inventory because. So, so <clears throat> mm -hmm. Alright, so you're back at the base. I'm going back to a gigantic rock that I found so I can get more cement. Oh, good. Um, but do you just need the rock? Yeah, get cement. Cement, cement. Well, yeah, let me. Uh, do I have a shovel on me? I probably do not. I think I got rid of my shovel. Oh, that's not good. <clears throat> it just means I get less when I do this, that's all. That's when you do what? Collect cement. Oh, okay. I am now level 32 from pounding on a pounding sand. Pounding? A pounding. And I got level 32. There's a floating trash can. That's pretty common in this game. No way, this game is too finessed to have something too... like that. Okay, anyways, stream, an update is coming up for this game. <laughs> Eventually. Well, soon. I think this month, actually. I think. I'm gonna run this zombie over with my bicycle. Nothing happened. There. Yeah, well, uh, yeah, so something is supposed to be coming for an update. Which is nice. Thank God. Nothing fancy, though. Hi there, Michael. I am out of stamina. Yeah, so <clears throat> the update. I gave you a pickaxe. Oh, yeah, that's right. Hang on a minute. Number seven, six. I'm out of stamina again. My character's thirsty. Do you have water on you? No. 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 That's a terrible idea. I'm out of stamina. Oh, thirsty. Bring water back here. I should just tilt my head back and open my mouth. <clears throat> Unfortunately, my character's too stupid to do that. <laughs> you do have the purifying... Mm-hmm, I'm real. Your character could do that. Yep.
take 20 stamina to swing this pickaxe. You have the power attack? What? Power attack, right? Oh. I got the regular one. Power attack, we'll see. Power attack's like 40. Container with me and just like scoop water out of toilets and stuff. Nasty. You're nasty. Yeah, but I got the thing on my head. How much of this rock do you want to get rid of? Most of it. Not all of it. A weird ass noise is coming from down the hall. I got like 800 stones and 35 cobblestones. beer balls is that what the the whole thing is is like you drink and then all of a sudden you can like <clears throat> super stamina and beat the crap out of things yeah, much. to That's get what it is. beer balls you get 300 percent brawling damage mm. which is three times a lot really 300 300 uh, percent is three times no uh, it's just fucking joshing <laughs> it's so i don't give a shit I say school's Tuesday, Mike. Mm-hmm. Believe that. Damn. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Probably get a job. Mm-hmm. Did you repair my bike by accident? Yeah. Sorry. Ah, uh, fine by me. All right. Uh, all the shit that you had. What do you need? Rock. Rock? You need cobblestone? Rock. Cobblestone? I said rock. How about cobblestone? You need shock shotgun shells? You have some shotgun shells? How about shotgun shells? Cobblestone. You have shotgun shells? Okay. I have shotgun shells. I don't have a shotgun, but you know.
God bless me. <gasps> All right. We're gonna have to start organizing these fucking things. All over it. Oh, actually, that's great. Good to know. Alright, so what are you up to? There's a tree growing into our base. <clears throat> so when the hatch is open inside of this base, does that mean that they cannot come in at all? Like it blocks them out? So if we built a little box up there, right? And we had a um, um, like a like a one block overhang just over the door, like an eave. And we had it like uh, the edge of the house. Um, oh. And we had like a, just a one block overhang, and we had it completely boxed in. So that way it was like one person sized. And the bottom of it was great. Michael, how many skill points do you have right now? I don't know, zero. Right. We both need to invest in... Um, intelligence first, please. Which one? Intelligence. So that we can get charismatic adventure. Charismatic nature. Oh, yeah. Because once you do it, you get plus one attribute. Every attribute, plus one. When people are near you, still get plus two. Which is overpowered. I don't know that we'll get plus two, but okay. <clears throat> oh, great issue, right? No, right now, um, people get inspired when they are near me. My allies gain a 20% health and stamina when they're near me, too. That's... Oh, you have that? I oh, I thought you didn't have a point. Apparently I have a point. Oh, look, there's somebody coming after you. Like, literally jump down the hole. Oh, she's dead. Oh, level 45! Hmm. There's a hell of a zoom on this thing. Sounds like Spencer's trying to be a tough guy out there. If you. Oh, this is a chicken. Should I see if I can shoot the chicken from here? Oh, because I don't have to go collect it. It's all the way over there. I'm good. Is there a bear anywhere? Possibly. Alright, so I guess I'll, um... Should I try doing that or no? Doing what? Building that little thing over there. Oh, if you want to, yeah. So right now, I'm getting the bonus from you. Which is super cool. Um, well... Are you getting the bonus from me? Um, cool yes, thing. I am. Because I get 152 max instead of 134. So that's pretty good. Um, uh, 132 is what it usually is. So it's now 152. So I was just looking at this, and maybe what I want to do instead see how far it reaches. is turn around and put it on the edge over here, so that way I'm shooting at a slight angle at them. Oh my god, Michael, it works from all the way over here. Yeah, I know, I'm still getting it. Um, my thing is greenlit. I, I guess that means yeah. that I'm giving it to you or something. I don't know. No, it means I'm giving it to you, okay. and mine's greenlit, which means I'm uh, getting it to you as well. 
But I'm thinking maybe doing it offset from the um, from the door, so that way there's no chance that they can jump up into it with me. And if they decide to like spit at me, I can just back up, and it won't affect me. As long as there's like, they'll mm. always keep coming for that door. Mm -hmm. As long as there's no other pathway. So as long as there's nothing else, then you're fine for building. You want really. I'm gonna take these frame cubes. I'm gonna use them and build and see what happens. This is cool, right? If I disassemble your ceiling, is it gonna just destroy all the block? What? The ceiling. If I open the ceiling, will it destroy the block, or do I get the block back? Because all that stuff that you put into the block will disappear. Never mind. I'm just going to do it. No. Dude, no. I'm just super confused. So what were you planning on doing? Cutting a hole in the ceiling. Where? Anywhere. So why would the rest of it collapse? No, not collapse. Am I going to lose all of the material, or is it going to give all the material back? Oh, no, you'll lose all of it. Well, that sucks. Alright, so... I'm going to cut this bad boy in the corner here. Fuck. I'm drinking the beer, but it's not doing anything. <laughs> Alright, so, you probably built up a tolerance to it now and you can never use it anymore. I don't know how that works. Oh. Maybe if I just drink more beer. <laughs> Call me a dick. I won't tell you why, but it's pretty obvious. shapes over here. I can just make it out of wood, right? Should yeah, and then you can upgrade them. I don't know if we'll have to. What's going to shoot me? A bird? Yeah, they shoot. Did you know that? I know they shoot, but I don't think I was going to have to actually worry about them. No, they do a lot. Oh, so disorienting. So, how do I build... Never mind, I don't need to know how to build. I got it. <laughs> Professional over here? How do I build? Yeah, I like this angle. I'm gonna, that's what I'm gonna do. The dog said wolf. Yeah. 
How many blocks high does it have to be? What are you talking about? Um, we can just go two blocks high, and it, that's high enough for a ceiling, right? Yeah, I guess so. Good, good. Broke a leg. No, okay. Hopefully, this does not get into your way at all. Probably won't. I mean, I literally just punch people, dog. So far, so good. I think. <clears throat> I think this will work. I think, this will work. I think it will. No guarantees. Okay. Oh. It'd be kind of cool, because then you could stand down there and just beat the crap out of them, and I could be up here and just pick them off. That would be kind of cool. Shapes. Of course, then again, I guess I don't need it to be like, I don't need the, uh, the corners don't need to be, I don't even know how to explain it. Never mind. Corners and like, the, the corners don't need to be there, do they? What is this? I mean, the corners are fine. This is mad ugly. Wait, so... Oh my god, Michael! What the hell did you do? I didn't do anything. The whole thing just fell off? Looks like it, man. Well, that's kind of messed up. <laughs> Where'd you get your degree in engineering? I only went two blocks out. That should have been fine. Zombie? No, that was a that was a Spencer. What the fuck? That's kind of my question, right? Now that sounds like an alarm clock telling us that it's midnight. Oops. Hmm. I need more shapes now.
Hmm. I hear you banging on shit out there. I'm banging. All right, I'm gonna craft uh, two more ladders. <clears throat> and then I'm going to craft wood shapes. I'm also going to need to get some fucking wood. All right. I'm just gonna cut down this fucking tree over here. What the fuck? The bro's got issues. Yep. <laughs> oh yeah. Maze is in here hiding. Please don't kill me. Yeah, pretty much. It's amazing how the street lights are still on. Yeah, the street lights are still on? Oh, you in the city? Um, sports area of all places, but the city lights are on. Okay, that's super weird. Yeah, I wouldn't think that anything would be on after this entire place got burned down. Right? But, you know what? So, you guys are running now. This should be fine. I thought I made wood shapes, and apparently I did not. Apparently you did not. No. For some reason, I still get charismatic nature, uh, whatever it is right now, mm -hmm. even though I'm definitely far away from it. I wonder if it means that you're actually just giving it off. Oh. Oh, no, maybe, I don't know. I'm mean, still says 152 from my stamina. Yeah, no, 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 but I get it too, so that means we give it to ourselves individually. Uh -huh. So that means we should get it double when we both get it. All right, when I oh. made, okay, I got a wood cube. How did I get a wood cube? Shit, screamer. A wood cube? Yeah. It's just the upgraded version. You can craft upgraded versions of blocks too. That's the upgraded version of the wood shape? Yeah, I don't really do that because I can get more HP by just upgrading. I meant to do wood frame, but apparently I did frame, I did wood shape or something. I don't know. Whatever. Breaking them is really easy. Alright, well fuck it. I'm just gonna put this up here and it's gonna look dumb. Fix it later. Okay, got you. You understand. Sounds good. Oh shit, there's a care pack. It's like... I would suggest you get it. Shapes, right? There we go. I remember the first time we played this game, we would like be on multiplayer and we tried getting on our bikes and stuff, and it was lag. Yes. So bad. So bad at this game.
I have no idea what that kid's doing. He's supposed to be going to bed. No. Oh. He's got an award ceremony on Monday. Oh my god, dude. Well, the fact that he actually got one, you know? Yeah. Which one? Which one? My dad. Which one? Oh. But you said my text. I was like, what? Oh no. Um. No, you said text me. I said, oh. Yeah, sure. I'll play some more after you were there. Just chill. I like it when they hit me once and then I fucking hit them and their brain explodes. <laughs> How would you drop your care bag in the water? That's kinda stupid. Six, so I get horn and armor. Nice. Wait, oh my god, I can't breathe in the water? Dude. You can't I didn't know that. breathe underwater? Alright, let's see what the armor bundle is all about. Cloth armor bundle. Dude. Well these aren't even better than what I had. I bet you can wear these though. Pretty good. That was a total diss, I'm sorry. But they're like level 6. I just wear heavy armor, so it's not good. I'm not really surprised that the cars in the cemetery. Zombie. Oh shit. You leave me. Okay. Iron bars. Iron bars? I know there's some in the chest. No, I mean like um like the ones that you use to make the the rail. Yeah, iron bars, like okay. metal bars made of four sides. Right. I swear, there's like a hundred in the chest. And I'm crafting more in the forge. Is he playing Apex or something? No, he's I, I think he's talking talking to the dog. Oh. Very, very intense about it. Yeah, he's been a little weird since that thing happened. Your, your mom made mention of it, and I'm like, you know, just let him try, okay? Let him try to be normal. Yeah, I see zero in here. Oh. Um. I don't know, maybe they aren't there then. <laughs> I swear there's some in the chest though. Mm. Oh, my mom. You mean, uh, like, because there are forged iron bars in here. Oh. Yeah, that's what I meant. Oh. No, well, never mind. Fuck it. Is there an anvil anywhere around here? I don't have an anvil. Alright, because. I want to make iron bars centered. Oh, you can, yeah, you can answer that. I need iron and I need clay. And I have both of them. Are you seeing the anvil? I don't know. I think so. Yeah, I need an anvil. Yumi <laughs> is still parking next to zombies and turning. Was there um is there an anvil inside the um, trader's place? I don't know. I know your secret stats will be different than mine though, so I might as well look through it. I meant more along the lines if I go in there, can I find one that I can use? Um Why not? Oh, not for free. Not at all. It just doesn't have it. And the fuck? It has a cement mixer? Yeah, but that one's broken. 
Everything's broken in there. She just doesn't fix things, I guess. She sucks. Got it. I know. Is it something we can find in the world or no? You can find like recipes to make them. So I've never found it. It's like sitting around. I guess it's a possible. Like a literal. Mm. Oh, that was amazing. I was just being dumb. I'm good for that on occasion. I don't know what I was just thinking. I just knocked out the bottom of my... Um, oh, and it all collapsed yeah. again? <laughs> no, not all of it. Just like that one corner. I'm like, what the oh. fuck? I don't know really, the structures are weird in this block uh, again. You like you can only place a certain amount down and then you go over that you all the way No. Trying to make it look better for you, okay? Oh, I'm so pleased. I should thank you, Oh, I'm like, why is it not working? And I'm like, oh, because I don't have any, I don't have wood. I'm woodless. Right, thank you. Yeah, I'm steep on price though. Yeah, well. I might get to use it someday. Yeah, one of those orgies. Yeah. Alright, time to literally fucking dump everything I own into um, Trader's place. I don't know what that means, but... Selling it. Oh. Apparently I'm hungry. Okay, never mind, she's not open yet. No, she's not open, by the way. She was. Hours are very, uh... Weird. So apparently I need wood, and I need, I don't know, what the fuck do I need, clay? Oh, I found a baked potato. Maybe it's rock. What do I need to, to upgrade this fucking thing? Um, cobblestone. What do you want? Cobblestone. You need cobblestone. Cobblestone. I have a lot of it right now. Okay. okay. Oh, you need wood, man. You also need cement, but I'm using that right now. I have wood. Oh baby, yeah. Oh baby, yeah. Oh yeah, you ready? Are no. oh, you fucking kidding me? What are you trying to do? This. I feel better. I just killed the zombie. Oh. I feel better now. Made you feel good? Mm-hmm. Thank you. 
feel like a big strong man now that you killed a zombie, huh? You murderer. You might want not to light yourself on fire. Yeah, I don't know. I'm out of currents now. Hmm. That seems like it could be a problem. It is. You never say, uh, bold. I don't know. Afterwards, I'll go outside and look at what we have. Because I might have to go outside and do it from the exterior. Hello, Trader Joel. Mm. Oh, she finally opened? Trader Jen. Oh, that's cool. It tells you in the bottom what you're missing when you um, go to do something. <laughs> Did not know that. Michael learns anything every day, guys. Yes, I do. Sometimes learning a new thing can take him more than a day. So what was that? You want me to run away and uh, jump through the window with the broken glass? Gotcha. Yeah. Can I put a car battery into our furnace? You can. <laughs> I can! I can put a car battery into our furnace. <laughs> I would love to inhale the fumes that come from that. I actually knew you could do that, just saying. You tried it already? Yes, I have. Hey, remember that time that you ate broken glass in this game? Oh yeah, that was fun. I was like, what the fuck? Yeah, I was really... I don't know why that's a feature. I don't, I don't know. Um, but I honestly was not, I was like, what the fuck is going on here? Why am I dying? I said you, right? I'm eating it. Now I got bleeding internally. That's yikes. Oh shit. You're gonna am die. Gonna die? Yes. Like actually just from death? Oh, you're pretty much dead. Do. Yeah, you're pretty much dead. Are you serious? Yes. I am losing health. I'm using a med kit. Shit. Try to bandage it. I actually did. <laughs> if I just out heal it, it'll go away. I don't know, but let me know if it works for you, because it's, um, I just died. <laughs> no, it's fine. I use a med kit. Just kind of med kits give you, like, stops bleeding, and it's internal bleeding, so. Makes no sense at all, but okay. Should not be able to stop it. I don't think it looks like it. Apparently, I need more cobblestone. Okay, so, um, yeah. I wonder if our base is just gonna explode after. I'm just gonna do a quest by myself if that's alright. No, it's not. Where's the fucking cobblestone? I'm bored. I'm doing this because I'm bored. I have cobblestone on you. I don't have any more. Is it all? Yeah. Oop, I fell off the side. Eee. Yeah, it is. Where's this quest we're doing? You do a quest by yourself. Motherfucker, I'm bored.
I wish if you press the back arrow while you were driving forward on a bicycle, you pop a wheelie. That'd be cool. are helpful. Um, Alright, let's go actually do the trading route one. Okay. I need to um, get that one, so hang on. I don't think you can share that one anyways. So, what are you buying today? Got any special jobs? Trading routes. You know, I... Hurry. Uh, I have a just protection payment desert. coming up soon. <laughs> I don't know, mine's 1.3 kilometers away. Yeah, mine is too. I think it's in the desert then. No, never mind. Where is my oh there it is. Apparently I'm hungry again. It would be kind of cool if um, some of the attributes stacked. So like, yeah, be so broken, yeah. But like, if I had the inspire and you had inspire, and we were standing next to each other, inspiring each other. No, I think it does stack though. Like, I think it just gives us. It's only two attribute points, which is still a lot though. I meant more along the lines of like, if I would give myself. A boost to stamina, and you would oh, you also do. give me a boost to stamina. Definitely do, because like, do you know how far away I am from you right now? Yes. There's no way. You're 250. I'm, you're, there's no way your perk is still affected. No. So that tells me that the perk works for ourselves, but the question is, does it work for the people around you? Yeah, it says, uh, it says friends around you. Right, but... Oh yeah, it does! Michael, because I had 195 stamina when I was next to you. Oh, okay. And right now I only have 176. Got it. So when I go back next to you and it says 195, then I'll know for sure. Are you going to the trader? Yeah, I am. Okay, we got different traders. No, we didn't. Yes, we did. Are you going towards the snowy nope. area? Nope. I am going towards the snowy area, actually, yeah. Okay, then we didn't get the same ones. Well, then where the hell are you going? Because you're 300 mile okay. meters and going the wrong way. No, I'm going through. Like, I'm, I'm just, like, going right through the train. I don't think I need these fucking zombies at the end. Oh shit, there's jaguars here. Kinda scary. So right now it says that your trader is 600 meters away? Well, 500, but yeah. I just got a, zam a zombie. A zombie and a, um... A zombie and a jaguar to fight each other. Shit, it's a jaguar. And I found a bear. And a bear found me. I, I, wait. I, am, I am currently pedaling my little ass off. Wow. And I, I just found um, jaguar. another jaguar. Hello, open the fuck up. Thank you. So, in a YouTube video, I was told that every trader does something special. So, this guy will be different than our Jen. I guess and Jen does like medicine for I don't think he'd pull it off. Here's your bounty. Oh. I haven't really noticed. 
obviously. This guy looks, well, this guy might be all guns because everything I'm looking at in the beginning here is like scrap boots, gunpowder, 9mm ammo, um, crossbows, time charges. I thought the wasteland guys was gun though. Mm -hmm. This guy seems to be hunting. Are we cooking then? Maybe? Mm, not really. Little shale crushes them. Well, I guess you ain't so bad. Here's a little something for your trouble. Why can't I look in this boy? Oh, Are you kidding me? I'm, oh my god, he's busy. I'm, I'm so in here, hang on. I'm getting out, just give me a second. I know, no, that's just dumb. Good luck with that. Oh my god, there's a zombie. Gyrocopter accessory schematic. Do we want that? Uh, if there's nothing Go for else, it. Talk to us. Be on your way. This is missing an eye. Alright, so. Okay, you have the same. This guy sells lockers, by the way. Yeah. This guy's all explosives and stuff. It's not really useful for me. Shift this duck maybe buy all of that. Oh, and I'll sell all of my car things too. There you go. We have a cooking grill and a cooking pot, right? So. How do I use... Can I use an old sink to fill up a water bottle or no? Oh yeah, he does. They're all tier ones, though. Music is so stupid. Oh my god, dude. I wish my bike wouldn't get stuck on the head plate. I think the zombie and the jaguar are fighting again. Actually, so far away. Why? Everything just questions and there's no biome. I am already there. What do you mean? You, how are you already there? Do you take a road? No. What do you do? I go yeah. down? Yeah. Why did it take me so long? Mm -hmm. There's a wolf here, though. Shoot it. Going to. Shoot him? I shot him right downstairs. 
I didn't know you had a gun. Are we doing anything in here, or what are we doing? The box. Ah, now. Hmm. Okay, got mine. You fighting somebody down there? Shit. You good? Stairs? There's a chainsaw schematic in here. Oh, chainsaws. I'll take that. Where are we? Okay, I see it's that. Is it upstairs? It's in this shed thing. Shot him and did a fucking spit. Echo in here. Hold on, man. I'm coming around. Nice, nice, nice. All right. What else we got? Right. Do you so need for more? For some reason, uh, I can't get onto my bike anymore. There is a lot. That's my bike. That's why. There's a okay. cement here. My bike. Cement. Cement. I don't care about cement. I don't care. Pick up your bike then. I'm. Um, it won't even. But just, there's no option. I. Oh my god. You, you just flipped the bike over. All right, what are we doing? Head back or what? Yep. And um, when we get back, I'm gonna have to eat something. Did you throw your bike at him? It is a wolf. Oh, it's red eyes and fucking huge. Damn, that thing took fucking shot after shot. <laughs> Did not want to die. All right, you want some meat? We're gonna get some meat. All right. Oh wow, I missed two shots on zombie. I missed three shots on zombie. Oh, that's a miniature boy. That's why there's so many of them. We are getting some meat. We are meated, buddy. Oh, there's another one right here. Shit, that's a jaguar. It is not a jaguar, and it is not looking happy, so let's... <laughs> that is not cool. Yeah, I fucking grabbed the wrong gun. Oh, yeah. 
I grabbed the AK, I meant to grab the rifle. The rifle would have one shot, but I grabbed the AK, and because I grabbed the AK, it had recoil and fucking everywhere, and yeah, no good. But, like this, I can just kind of go... You motherfucker. I hate that. Fucking gun reloads every time I go to use it. No head. Huh? I just blew his head right off. Alright. I don't think I can get any meat off of a zombie, so I'm just gonna ride away. Give me some pipe bombs. Getting pipe bombs? Nice. I was gonna slide in this guy's back door, but he did his uh he's like uh, he's completely sealed off in the back. I share another question by the way. Alright, give me a minute to get rid of this thing. Let me get some fucking food. Is there any place I can cook some meat? Uh, Nickel you ain't worth a dime anymore. Oh, shit now. Well, Boston, you did it, so, so I'll cool. honor our agreement. I think I'm just gonna go with the ammo. Oh. Sawed off shotgun mod. Uh. <clears throat> That's enough chit chat for me today. Oh, did you do it? What? You the quest done? Not yet. Give me a second. I gotta. I'm just trying to eat. My character is like, I'm fucking dying. Still hungry. Well, I guess I'll have to fix that one. Oh well. Thank you for the sub. There we go. Where are you? Oh, that's right. You're. I'm right in. Yeah. a minute here. Do you have any lock picks you can lock safe? I do have some lock picks. Hang on. Oi, oi, oi. Where are you? Okay, where's the uh, where's the safe? It's just in his house. Just randomly look for a safe. Well, what kind of loud oh, it's customer it's are you anyway? nice so. Oh, how do I get in there? Well, you have to go next to him, of course. You're right here. What's your brain? I can pick up locks. Oh my god, I can! Holy crap, bro, for real? <laughs> Probably just not gonna happen. I don't know. It'd be funny if it like there's like some sort of like 50 cal or something, something stupid in there. Oh, he's got ammo and he's got steel club parts. Oh. Can you use the steel club? Um. Can I use the steel club? Yeah, but I don't. Hmm, okay, well, that'll work. Do you want some oak seeds? Because I got some. I don't know what they're for. Well, um, I wonder what oak tree. I know what they're for. You know what I mean. I'm trying to see what I have. All right, did you do the quest? Oh, no, I keep forgetting. Hey, I want to eat some glass first. Can you hang on? Uh, I don't have any quests in here. Oh, I mean, 
No shared quests. Did you already? No, Michael. I meant. Uh, did you? What do you need me to do? Okay. <sighs> I was asking if you already like got the rewards for the quest. Oh. Um. I think I did. Oh, I hope you did. Uh, well, if I didn't, I didn't. Did I just accept that? Yeah, I must have gotten it because he's not offering me anything, so. Alright. Oop, I just fell right off the freaking map here. Alright. I am very hungry. No, I guess I'll be um, looking through the cabinets when we get to this house. Way back! You want to check out shells? Oh my fucking lion chasing me, yay. I'll probably die. I'll probably die. Let me go this way. What's with all these freaking mountain lions, man? I have to go around the mountain. I'm noticing this. Of course, I noticed it a little too late, but at least I'm noticing it now. There's a lot of like, I don't, is this iron? What is this here? Probably iron. And there's a bear. Does it move? No. Shit, I'm scared. Oh my god. I don't know how I'd even bike through this shit. I, I don't know. I'm wondering how they're biking at all. I mean, you. I have tried to ride a bike in snow. Guess what does not happen? The snow does not make you levitate above it. No, it does not. Bro, I'm this coming down. Bigger than the rest. Yes. Oh, oh, this house is one of my favorites. <laughs> you want me to like take this guy apart and get us some food? Okay, then I'll do that. Just for you. You got there. And I've got a zombie. Get it! Oh, you motherfucker. Get out of here. Okay. All right there. Yeah, fly. Just messing around. All right, where are you? And why are you in this house already? Did you kick me out of the quest? Oh. Eat, eat, eat. Okay. Whoa. You know what? Close this stupid door. You keep clearing. I'll just keep eating. Don't worry. We're good. Maybe. Hmm? I said maybe. Oh, maybe to what? Me eating. Oh. There does not seem to be a lot in here. You know what I like about the quests, though, on these houses? What? Resets the loot. Huh? Resetting the loot. Oh, yeah. Get out of my way. I have a feeling there's going to be no food in this garbage. There is glue, though. Do you need glue? You got glue. Okay, well, we have it. Oh, wow. Uh, Shamway sealed shipping container. Guess what's in here? Shamway. Well, no shit. I don't know where the rest of the time is. I got spam. Oh, is it? Oh, it's a can of chili. A couple of bags, a couple of things to chill. You know, that's great, because now i got chili, I'm gonna end up with like dysentery or something. That'd be fine. I must be encumbered. Okay, if there's a, um. I should, yeah. I need more food. What? Yeah, you can have it. 
That was one of my favorite weapons of the last character, though. We're getting a buff, by the way. What? The, um... No kidding. So it'll be actually useful. I liked using them. <laughs> hey, did you say you needed more lead? Oh, uh, yeah. But I just a lot of well, we've got a lead trophy now, so... Polymers... Oh, hold on. Oh, by the way, the quest is done. Oh, okay. You got 44 cals. Uh, 44 cal. 40, 44 magnum bullets. Uh, do you want a military glove? No, I had a better one. Okay. Oh, what is, what is this? Random crap people hiding behind their pictures. You leave already? Yes. Thank you for leaving me behind. I appreciate that. You're welcome. I remember that on my deathbed. Okay. I'm going to go around the other way. Wow. Okay. Really? What? I would have. I could have sworn I would have had enough momentum to have made it up that hill, but apparently, no, I did not. No. As soon as you like just get off the pedal, it like stops completely. Mm-hmm. I'm just gonna walk over this hill. It'll be faster. Oh, must be encumbered. Or I just suck at jumping. One or the other. Alright. Okay, shot off shotgun one. Yeah, that was the one I was talking about before. Put that onto my shotgun. I can't! So that is what? fucking amazing. <laughs> I can't put a shot off shotgun mod on a shot off shotgun. I'm a um, little girl, which is like notorious for having that. Yeah. Super. Oh man. Might be a half press and go over all the stuff that's set up on this on the uh, Twitch account and everything. Sure, I'm almost over here. I'll show. You. I'm about to sell some of the stuff I have because I apparently have too much. It says big load on back eight. Yikes! Drop your weapons or drop your door. You're almost okay in my book. Insulated liner mod. So, is old cash worth anything good? Uh, need a steel, but do you need a bicycle chassis uh, schematic? No. All right. I'm gonna share another question. By the way. Okay. I'm just trying to get some stuff done. I need more. Uh... Old cash. Yeah, I, I get 197 stamina. I'm kind of close to you. So. Hmm. Not bad. Oh, well, I'm still getting it, I guess. So. Let's sell the battery. What else do I have here? Hmm. 
Oh, you're not interested in that item? Well, F you. Do you need glue for anything? Yes. Okay, I got some glue. I think I will, uh, I think I'll call that good. If there's nothing else, you best be on your way. No, nothing else, you best be on your way. Shut up. Okay. Got a lot of fur. I should have sold the leather, rather. I have so much junk. Damn things are selling like hotcakes. Hmm. All right, there's that. Cool. All right, so now I'll join you in, I don't know. In my quest. Yeah. I got lockpicks. All right, we're good. Whoops. All right, that should be it. And I have glue for you, too. Oh, the music inside that place drives me insane. I don't know. Maybe it's just... Ugh. Same house again? Yeah. Not same house. No. I mean... Sorry. Well, I gotta go back Very... over the mountain again. Yeah. <sighs> well... This time I'm gonna go to the right. I will. If I get any stamina. Wow, you drinking in real life sounds as bad as the game drinking in the game. Does that make sense? Speaking of which. Oh my god. You know, it really is better to just get off and run when you're trying to go up a hill. <laughs> so bad. Come on, come on, you can do it, you can do it. Or maybe you can't because you kind of suck. But still, you can try. Keep trying. Oh my god. So bad. You are so bad at life, you just, you suck at life. Oh my god. You seeing this, people? Oh my god. There we go. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh my. F this game. All right. Oh. You know, I don't know really how I feel about the whole, like, creating new characters things, because... Well, I, oh, that's right, I forgot to tell you. The, um... You can get 21 right now. You, you, you were talking about the, um... Uh, the next mod on this thing, the next, uh, whatchamacallit. Yeah. And you can get 21, but the problem is, is none of your 20, which is what we're on, none of those saves will work. Basically, it's a completely different game. Nothing worked anymore. Oh, this is a Jaguar. Oh, 
Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, oh shit, it's a great ass time, mate. Ah, oh, what, the Jaguar? I just fell off the damn yeah. stairs. We're, we're outside, because I'll kill it. What the fuck? He's right in the fucking kitchen. Oh my god, I had to reload. He did. You good? Yeah, I hit the Well, I don't have a problem killing him, but I just... Oh fuck, I gotta find mine. Um... Of the Jaguars? Yeah. Cannot believe I just missed that shot. He did. And I'm still hungry, so I'm gonna eat this. Oh, I forgot about the Jaguar. I'm gonna go grab his meat. Oh. Wait, shut up, bitch. Fuck you. All right, um. This guy had better have, yeah, 450. What? I only got 10 meat off of him. Fuck that bitch. So pissed. Do we need paper for anything? Let me scrap that. Pipe bombs. Yeah, too. I keep getting Oh. Hey, I mean, if that float, what if floats your boat, bud? Yeah, I'll drop this off and then um, I'll head towards you. Um, what day are we on? Nine. Hmm. Once we get to ten, they have a restock, so we'll see what's new. Oh. Yeah. No, it's just. I do want to get off soon? Yeah, I know. Same. That's why I was asking what day it was. Bro, for real? I told you that already, Michael. Oh, that's right, you did. Never mind. It's almost done. I just gotta revise it. It's an argumentative essay, which I might be his favorite. Oh, all you have to do is just think about it like you're talking to your sister. You'll be good. sensitive topic <laughs> don't fund them and nobody's there to um, do anything for you or protect you or anything along those lines or... this over people like it's not looking good for guys on it there now oh it definitely is. hundred cases of misconduct yeah which is not a big deal most cases yeah. of misconduct are Things where it's like, oh, well, he used his lights when he wasn't supposed to, so. What? Trader Joe's no, like, is now no. closed. Under evidence. Uh, fucking. Unnecessary force. Legal searches. 
Yeah. So you said what? Two hundred. Mm, two hundred thousand. Yeah, I still don't see the problem. That's a massive problem. Are you kidding me? Be me. How is that a problem? That sounds. How is that, not a problem? that sounds like a management issue. That doesn't sound like a problem. It's both a management issue and a uh, issue. I don't know, all I gotta say is I'm glad I'll be dead soon because if people are gonna be dumb enough to defund the police, I wanna be dead before it happens. Cause... This is why I have to be careful with what I say on the argument. Why? Because literally anybody older than you will be like, oh, the, the, the. No, because the whole idea of defunding the police basically uh, says you want to be in a society with no rules. So if you want to be an anarchist, be an anarchist. But just have the balls to say that, you know? That's literally what it breaks down to. It's not a matter of, you know, it's not looking good for the police or it is looking for good for the police. It's a matter of do you want anarchy or do you like law and order? Because, I mean, the whole idea behind saying, yeah, I want to defund the police because there's all this going on, that's not an issue with the police. That's an issue with individuals. And that's shit that you handle on an individual basis. And anybody who, you know, takes a minute and looks at it would realize that. You know, that's why there's body cams. That's why, you know, that's that's why there's dash cams. I mean, it's all there for that reason. They, they can't. They're not... They're not supposed to be turning those off. And that's, no again, shit. that is an individual issue. That's not a police issue. I would, I will honestly tell you that out of the, the thousands of cops that I've met over the years, there's probably only been about maybe three or four of them that I thought in any way, shape, or form were not good people. So, I mean, again... The whole idea of defund the police basically is saying, I want anarchy. I mean, there's there's literally no reason to even have that argument. It's... Hmm? There is, like, they want to have, like, communities, like, tight-knit communities. Oh, that's not going to work. They've already tried that. It ended horrifically. Actually, um, uh, petty crimes went up over 4,000%. Oh, yeah. um, and then um, major crimes like, for example, rape, assault, and that sort of thing went up over 200%. Um, you know, and I mean, what did the community do for it? Oh, shame, shame. I mean, really, is that that's your, your go-to? Is you're going to shame the people? What do you, you can't do anything to the person. You can't. I mean, as soon as they, they tried, the, in one community, they tried to... Um, uh, take their own justice out on somebody who was literally going around robbing people and just, you know, like beating people up that were getting in their way. And so the community decided that they were going to go and um, they were going to go and police the situation themselves. They were going to exact justice on the individual. So he just went and started killing everybody. And the whole reason why is because there was no cops. And they, he even said this, that, uh, he even said if there was cops, I wouldn't have killed anybody. If there was cops, I wouldn't have robbed anybody. But there was no cops. There was no law. So why should I care? I'm like, wow, well, okay. <laughs> so, I mean, it's... Oh, shit. So I'm not getting the speaking thing anymore. Yeah, I don't see it either on mine. And I'm down to 134. There's too many factors that, that are involved in the, the whole idea yeah, of defund like, the police. You know, it's the thing is, is that like for the most part, you got to keep in mind is if the police aren't there, then what is the, what do you, what is it that you're intending on replacing them with? Because there will always be a replacement. And if you think that the idea of private policing is a great idea, I suggest you first. Same idea as private well, what's Terrible. Let me let me put it to you this way: How much do people enjoy a, uh, H um, uh, HOAs? I have no clue. Sorry. Uh, they're pretty much housing uh, like um, like uh, communities where um, there's a housing authority, 
and everybody has to follow the exact same laws, the exact same rules, the exact same mandates, or else they get fined and harassed by the HOA uh, members. Oh, the homeowner association. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, that's pretty much what you're, you know, what you're looking at in lieu of police, because instead of the police being there to ensure that things are kept civil and to, you know, to assist people in situations where um, they've been wronged or they need protection or anything else. Instead, now you've got people doing it that are just private citizens. But in one way or another, something's got to take over. And I will honestly tell you that I am not listening to a private citizen fucking ever. So bring that shit on and I will show you um, what the, uh, what the, what was the name of that movie? The Purge? Oh, oh yeah, I'll show you what that shit's like. Because I will be fucking owning everything I ever wanted. <laughs> and I'll be protecting it all by killing people. My argument is not for really funding. Mm -hmm. It's to increase the amount of funding to training. That is a great idea. Because three billion dollars past decade to settle cases of misconduct. That is a lot. Training. Yes. Well, training is a good idea, but I think really, honestly, there has to be um, the the repercussions need to be real. Like, for yeah, example, that's also you, part of my they should not be so, turning off body cams for any reason okay, whatsoever. Go ahead. So they have something called it's a protection, basically, with the state laws, and it's a federal law that protects them from paying for um, like. Um, this kind of cases that are deemed not unconstitutional at that time, which could mean pretty much anything. So they end up getting off of it. Like this year, over 2,000 people were shot in like cop shootings, mm -hmm. and only 11 cops were held accountable. Which is just like. And it's not even like that they were like actually like doing anything. So 50% of those people had guns, right? Mm -hmm. One fifth of them were not planning on using the gun. They just wanted to like pocket it out. And then they got shot. But well, and here's something. 111 of them just like people that were having like a mental health crisis. And they literally like were just kind of freaking out. They thought just like. Bang, bang. Them unarmed. Well, here's the thing. You gotta keep something in mind. If you are out there and you let's just say you are an officer, right? And you see somebody and you tell them to stop because they're there's they're in one way or another you suspect them of uh, of a violent crime. Mm -hmm. And you tell them to stop. To cease, put your hands up. You know, you talk to them, you repeat your commands, you tell them over and over, and then you see them start reaching into their um, yeah, into their coat. You know that they've gone in and they just they performed an armed robbery no more than 20 minutes before you, yeah. you met up with them. They're reaching into their jacket. They're not saying anything at all. They're just reaching quickly into their jacket to pull something out. What's your initial response to that? You've got your gun drawn and you're that staring them down. You would what? I wouldn't shoot them. Okay, so you wouldn't shoot them. Now he pulls out a gun and he fires on you. Now what are you doing? Other than bleeding on the ground, what are you doing? You see what I'm saying? Not really. It's easy to say, oh, well, you know, I wouldn't shoot somebody because, you know, I wouldn't want to kill somebody who is innocent. Well, at the same time, is you also have a choice. You can choose to either... Um, do nothing and chance being killed yourself, not go home and see your family. Or you can choose to not fatally wound somebody. What are you shooting? Is he at the door? Where is he? Oh, never mind. He's dead. Um, yeah. 
But those, some of them were unarmed too. Which yeah. Which is like the worst case scenario. I don't know how you shoot somebody unarmed. I do, and I can even tell you how it happens. Okay, well I know if they like quickly pull something out. Mm-hmm, that's one of them. Yes. Just shoot them. But here's, um, here's, okay, so there was, and I actually saw the video on this one. Um, there was, um, officers that were chasing a, um, oh, are you getting the meat? Um, there were officers that were chasing a guy who had just robbed a store. And he did have a gun on him. Um, and it was... Oh, no, Michael, I'm talking about, like, getting pulled over for, like, speeding. Not, like... This is just from like traffic stops. Yeah, I mean, in traffic stops, there's a lot of things you got to keep in mind. If people start reaching for stuff in the car, what can you see? Yeah, you can't see shit. And I mean, now you're looking at it as, do I get to go home and see my family, or do I have to worry about whether or not I'm going to uh, deca uh, de 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 sorry, um, incapacitate this person? I mean, that's really what the choice comes down to. You know, do you want to go see your family, or do you want to? You know, do you want to give this guy a chance to um, pull something out and kill you? I mean, that's a lot of the times what it comes down to. That's how that happens. If you really want to know, that's what does it. That's how it happens. Why are you doing that on the roof, by the way? What? The grates. Oh, I don't know. I speak. Oh, you, need, you probably do them on the uh, other building. Oh, really? Oh, I don't have enough cement. Um, Any cobblestone to finish the walls on that one. But, like, I don't want to get into, like, I told my teacher already I don't want to get into, like, politics in this essay. Because mm -hmm. then that's when people are going to start oh, yeah. not listening to the essay anymore. Mm -hmm. As soon as I talk about, like, left or right. Yep. And it's super annoying because <laughs> news sources will literally just cover shit up completely. Oh, yeah. Like, I've. It took, it, I've had to get like extra days because I just, it's so annoying. Well, it's all like, um. truth of the matter is there is good points to both sides. There is good points to defunding and there is good points to not defunding. And, you know, the honest to God truth is you got to look at it and go, what is the best case scenario in both ways? What is the worst case scenario in both ways? And then you got to figure it out from there. And the hardest part about it is because you want to write an uh, you want to write an essay that's um, you know argumentative. You're gonna yeah. you're gonna run into that's a problem no matter what way you do it. That's why. Well, I can't really run into a problem if my essay is about putting more like money to train. No. I mean, you do, because then you have people who are like, no, you shouldn't put money into training. Why put more money into our broken system? You should just completely remove all funding. The system is broken. Well, and There's a lot of things wrong with it that I've seen. Mm -hmm. Like, cops can just choose to skip over, like, um, de-escalation training, which is literally what cops basically do for their entire job. Mm -hmm. Like, if somebody is just, like, you know... Um, I don't know, it's like, okay, just, I don't really know, I know there's like a ton of shit, I just can't think of one, like, some dude is like, okay, this is what trying to hit, some dude's like yelling at you and getting aggressive, mm -hmm. um, obviously you don't want to start yelling back, because that would just make you more aggressive, you know, mm -hmm. so, cops can just skip over the escalation training, because there's no minimum time requirement for it, and then, mental illness crisis training which is for like people who obviously aren't right in the head like, yeah um, but now you're asking an officer to not only uphold the law and to serve and protect but you're also asking him to be a case manager not really what they're there for i don't know what a case manager is. well short well short version is this the police are, are supposed to be there to protect and to serve which essentially means that what they're there to do is to be there for you to help you in a situation where you need assistance. That is what they're there for. And the protect part of it comes down to, where are the zombies? I can hear the music. I don't know. The protect part really comes down to, you know, making sure that you, that people are not harming one another. That is really what their jobs are. You know, and as far as like, 
in a situation where things are, you know, beyond control. Like you've got somebody who's, um, you know, like the the whole situation's been escalated, and they're upset. They're yelling. They're screaming. Now what? Okay, well, yeah, you're supposed to try to calm them down. No question. But at the same time, if you know, if somebody's upset, somebody's upset. If somebody's on drugs, somebody's on drugs. If somebody's having a mental breakdown, somebody's having a mental breakdown. Thing is, is that officers are not supposed to be trained to do that because they're trained to make sure that people are safe. And really what it comes down to is in that sort of a situation, what they're trained to do and what they're supposed to do is detain the people that are uh, involved, that are, you know, causing it, uh, causing it to be an unsafe situation. Why are you running around? This is not track. Um, I know, like, I know they don't need to, like, know exactly, like, what mental illness and what, like, medicine they're supposed to give this person, mm. but they only get, like, 10 hours of train time for that, mm -hmm. and, like, there's no way you're gonna know, like, what somebody's, like, currently going through. No. Like. Even with training, they wouldn't, but, yeah. Yeah. Like, you'd have more of a clue. In 10 hours... They get like 120 hours of combat training, which is a lot, which mm -hmm. is needed, mm -hmm. but they just need more training time, I think. I think it should be definitely required at least like 10 hours of the escalation training. Yeah. And they can also skip a formal field training course too, which is kind of crappy, and two thirds of them do do that. Well, I think the reason that you see that is because, honestly, the whole idea behind the police is just for them to maintain the law. That's it. Their whole job is just to say, this is what the law is, this is the way it needs to be, and if you're not conforming to it, you are being fined or you are being removed from the situation because you can't handle, you know, simple adult things like follow the rules. <laughs> Yeah. You know, and I mean, that's really what the police were formed for. The police, the police in general were not formed for anything except for to ensure that people were following the rules. You know what the military is there for? Uh, to kill people that, uh... Nope. They are there to enforce the rules. That is what the military is for. And do you know who the chief of police for the military is? No. The president of the United States. His job is to enforce the rules of the country. That is what his job is. That's why they call it the executive branch. And with that, he has the police at his hands is the U.S. military. So, I mean, and it's the same thing in that situation. You know, the, the whole idea is um, that they're supposed to be there to serve and protect. So... All of the uh, all of the things that people are told about what the police are there for and what the military is there for aren't really true. I don't get taught a lot about that stuff in school. That's because it probably should be. Well, I was actually a civics teacher back when civics was a course. It's no longer civics a thing. Is still a course, but it's optional. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, no. I think that um, I think you should go ahead and write your opinion with the facts that you found. And I think you should, um, you should I'm definitely. Going for like, so it's an argument, so I have to put points for both sides. Mm -hmm. So that's where I got the info for the misconduct cases. Basically, I told my teacher, um, people don't understand money more than the misconduct cases. Mm -hmm. So $3 billion over the past decade, people are going to be like, wow, that's a lot more than 200,000 misconduct cases, right? But that's 200,000 misconduct on the cases over only 75 theft cops and only 35 of those cops actually got i mean 35,000 of those cops got fired and how long is that time frame that you're looking at um for so this time frame are you talking about the um kind of cases yeah over what time frame oh okay so like a decade so like so 10 2020 so it, just kind of break it down real quick then. So what you're saying is that there's twenty, there's 22,000 of them, you said? No, no, no. Okay, so $3 billion was used mm -hmm. to settle, I don't know how many misconduct cases over the past decade, Yeah. but there's 200,000 uh, misconduct or more mm -hmm. um, misconduct cases in 2022. 
So 20,000 misconduct cases annually. 200,000, not 20,000, mm -hmm. sorry. Which is 20,000 annually. Yeah. According to your figures. Oh. What? 20,000 annually, because you said it was over a decade, so. No, Michael, 200,000 in one year. Okay, you said that was a decade. <laughs> no. no, no, no. Okay, sorry, no. So... Okay, this isn't part of the 200,000. It's just 3 billion in America, like, total misconduct cases. Just, like, from whatever apartment. Just selling them. And 308, like, I think 900 million in Chicago alone. That I'm not surprised about, actually. That's, that's really not surprising. That's where mostly, like, cancel the police thing is coming from. Which I understand, because I know the police there are kind of, like, bribed and stuff. Well, the, the biggest problem with Detroit is that control and gangster mentality is all out of control. It's ridiculous. Um, There's tons of riots there and stuff. Well, the thing is, is that the people have decided that they're not going to listen to anybody. They're going to do what they want. And at the same time, the police are like, we need to enforce these laws. And because the people aren't allowing them to enforce the laws... The officers are taking liberties because they don't have much of a choice. Their, their people are not giving them the choice to be able to do the right thing. And then on top of that, now the officers are pushing too far. And because they're pushing too far, the people are pushing back saying misconduct, yeah. which they're not wrong. But at the same... People in the wrong too. And that's the thing is, is in, in you just you picked an area that is horrific in every single way. They are so close to a point where I would say national the National Guard should be called in and just militarize the area and you know, just just outright say you guys are all in lockdown. <laughs> well, actually, Michael, that would be a good place to put you know police law anyways. <sighs> because if you think about it, we don't get much income from that area. No, but um, even still, the and we don't want like police officers getting hurt or like gang violence. No, but at the same time, what do you think is going to happen if you pull all the police out? Now there's nobody there, the, and yeah, the no. people have already proven that they're not interested in policing themselves or doing the right thing. And I mean, it's not everybody either, because there are a lot of really good people that live there. And they want better things in life. And some of those people are afraid of the police because of what they've seen. And they're not wrong, you know. But at the same time, is that's just a really bad place because they just... Really... Every city is just, it's so heavily populated that mm -hmm. there's like a huge mass of people. Mm -hmm. Like... Yeah, well, it's it's There's difficult. also like, sorry. No, go ahead. I know like California as a whole, as a state, is pretty bad too. Parts of it, yes. Um, and again, I mean, it comes back down to what you just said again, the cities. And it has more to do with the fact that there's a lot of people in a very small area per capita. There are a lot of people across a very small amount of land. Um, and that means more money for robbers. Well, I mean, it really, what it what it comes down to is it's it's harder to deal with those areas. It's harder to police them, and it's harder to keep things straight. And I mean, some people, a lot of those places, you end up with like the impoverished, and because they don't have money, they don't have a way to be able to get out. They find other means, and that's when they turn around. And they're like, hey, you know what? This gang sounds really good. Let me do this. Yeah. You know, and that's the type of thing that leads to that horrible behavior. That destroys the entire area you know and it's and in some cases it's it really comes down to what came first the chicken or the egg you know which one was was worse first was it the police that were causing it or was it the people that were causing it and it's so hard there's no way to be able to look at it and say this is the right solution because everything is so like the it, history just gets way back. yeah and it's like you don't know um, yeah, I'm coming back. Um, you don't know which way is caused it. You know, is it, is it the police that are causing the issue or is it the people? Is it both? You know? I, I honestly, there's no good answer for that. Mm -mm, and no. there's no amount of training that you can do. It's like, I know there's some wild shit that goes down there. Yeah. And I don't, I don't even think you train, like, Okay, 
one of the big points of my argument is that like well not really it's not even a big point are you going to this quest by the way yeah i'm already there basically but um police officers need more time like invested in the training mm -hmm. um basically they can have less hours than like an electrician a plumber or a barber and they can still be a police officer and obviously those three jobs need a lot of time like electrician um plumber and barber they're all very like they're hard to do, like hard to learn, you know. They're they're crafted skills. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But like police officers, um, they kind of just get like put right into it. Mm, you need they to look into that. There is a required. There is a college requirement. There is well, yeah, also. Requirement. There is also a police academy training that they have to go through as well. That's in my essay. So it's not a matter of them just being thrown into it. There's actually a little more to it than just that. Um, and the police training that they go through does include some of the things you're talking about, by the way. Um, but probably, I would say, in the same percentage as what you're talking as well. You know, the percentage of combat training, uh, the percentage of uh, de-escalation, the amounts that are the percentage of um, uh, uh, mental health uh, crises, all of those things are in there, um, but all of them are at very small percentages, except for combat training, uh, tactical training, uh, personal. What's that? Learning like all the laws and shit. Yeah, I mean, it's it, all of that stuff and, and the, the legal parts of it, understanding the laws and stuff, most of that comes from your college courses. Um, yeah. But there definitely is some of that in there as well. There's, there's, there is classroom time. I just think that, like, are there storage on these bikes? I don't know. That'd be kind of neat. Oh my god, there is. It's really tiny. Um... I just think that they just need more time. Mm. It's like, I know that it's mostly like messing up and shit. So. I think it's actually um, officers that have got, become complacent with their jobs. The older oh, ones, like the ones that have been there for 10 years, soon 15 years, the ones that are looking towards retirement. Those are the ones yeah. I think have the biggest problem with it. And the reason I, I think. I think it's because they believe that they are above the law to an extent. I mean, yeah, that's part of my thing too. Um, cops aren't held accountable, and then they start like, oh, by the way, the splitter mod here. Okay, this one. They aren't held accountable, so it's kind of like there's no. If I do this, something bad is gonna happen to my job. And that kind of goes back to what I was saying before about the fact that it's it's a management issue. Yeah, that's that's actually that's like a big part of mine. Um, there's laws preventing police officers from being persecuted, doing like whatever they want. Basically. Oh, yeah. this is the big house, but they can basically just like do some shit and get away with it. Like, of course, it has its limits, mm -hmm. but get away with. A lot more than you know a normal person would obviously you mean an officer is given a little more leeway yeah a lot more in some cases. yeah that is true there's the well it also depends upon the um the police chief too because sometimes the police chief just turns around and goes yeah i don't effing care so just stop yeah. doing it and getting caught Fuck, i'm dead i'm dead They just started raining down on top of me. Not dead though. No, I'm not. This is the end of the tunnel, by the way. This goes back out to the garage. Yeah. Is it the garage? No, no, I forgot my thing. This is a clearing. Um. 
Um, uh, clear us, uh, yeah. So wasteland treasures, uh... Where? Um, hang on. Oh, hey, there's tech junk. What is your thingy? It's like, they're above. Behind it. You get yours already? No, mine's on the other side of that barbed wire. Oh, okay. Mine's right here, Mike. Okay. I'm gonna go grab mine. If I can find my way downstairs. Gave up trying to find my way around. Yeah, I don't know. It's a weird pop. Look, um, two kids did theirs on like trans athletes. My view is that it's just like. Well. Because a dude, or like a dude that went to be like become a girl. Mm hmm. So like, there's this weightlifting guy, he said he wanted to be a girl, right? Yeah. So, he took estrogen. And then before, like, the thing was jacked up on testosterone. And he of course broke the record by a fuck ton. Which makes sense, because you know, full of testosterone, basically a dude, again. Yeah. That shit. I want to be like... I want to be a chick, play by fools, man. Well, no, I agree, and I mean, but then at the same time, is you've got, um, you've got women that are like, well, you know, we should be judged the same as men. So correct me if I'm wrong, but didn't they just prove by, no, I, you know? No, I mean, like, they mean by like respect, respected as much. No, I mean just in general. I mean, it's like. You've got, there are, there's a, I can't remember what her name was, but there was a woman that it was just recently, I remember reading about it, and she was like, well, you know, uh, we should be paid the same amount as uh, the men athletes, which is uh, WBA, the women's basketball. Oh, there is um, a couple things on that as well. But she's um, like, she was like, well, we should be paid the same amount as the men, and it's like, okay, well, let me ask you something. How much revenue do you pull in? Kind of I rough. Knew you That's could the do whole it. thing. You so, didn't get bit, did you? They just, they aren't like entertaining as much as the dudes, so they don't. It's not like, it's not really a sport. It's more like entertainment. So even if you're good enough, if you're not entertaining, you're not gonna get to watch you. And yeah. I hope you get feeling better. Do you need shotgun shells? No, um, what my what I, what my whole thing with it is is like uh, she's like oh well you know we should be paid the same amount as what the men are paid and everything and like I was saying is the first thing that went through my head was are you bringing in the same revenue? Yeah. Because the one thing that people seem to forget is for every time honestly looking, it's a business. Every all of it's a business, and it's like. You know, you're not going to make the same amount of money working at the corner store, you know, as you would if you were working for a major retailer. You know, it's just, you know, if, if, um, if your company is selling um, cereal and, you know, you want to, you know, you want to, uh, your company has like 10 employees total. Accept it, by the way. I did not yet. Sorry, I forgot. So if you got 10 people working for you. Oh, no, you didn't even share it, dude. Oh, I didn't toggle it active? Uh, I didn't toggle it active. 
I got it. Yeah, I got it. Um, but like, if you got ten people in your company and you're selling cereal and you're making fifty boxes a month, you're not going to make the same amount of money as if you would if you were working for Kellogg's. Mm. You just not. So it's kind of like saying, okay, well, you know, me and my uh, my company, or you know, even even more so, is like, for example, if you were uh, if you're working for Target or if you're working for Walmart, that's an apples to apples for you. So in that case there, that's like the WBA and the NBA, okay? You've got the same amount of people on the team, same amount of people who are doing that job in both situations, but the difference is in one of those, you're making more money because the company makes more money. Yeah. Because I guarantee there's not one person that's making the same money that, you know, somebody at the warehouse in Walmart is making more money than the person who is, um, the person who is working at a Target uh, warehouse guaranteed is there stairs going upstairs i don't know that yeah there are the argument's kind of silly um there are sports where women make more money than the men mm -hmm. and i don't know why they aren't looking at that as an example well i mean it just i think really it just comes down to is like you know what are you bringing in what what is the revenue because if you're if you are not bringing in as much money, your company does not make as much money, you cannot expect to be making as much money as the bigger company. You just can't. And that's what it comes down to. Sports are a company. It's an entertainment franchise. So what do you, what do you want? You want to you make as much as, uh, as the next person, then you kind of got to be as entertaining as the next person. Yeah. I think I found your right rear supplies, by the way. There's also a vault. In okay, well, I'm trying to... Get up up there, but oh my god, anything else? Up there? there we go. Oh, there definitely is. Did you find the uh, the okay? Yep, you did. That's mine. Oh, there's a safe here. By the way, there's a couple zombies coming down. Okay, well, if you can handle them, I'm gonna pick this safe. Oh yeah, I threw a pipe on at them. Uh, maybe I'm not gonna pick the safe. I don't have any lockpicks on me. Oh my god, I fucking nuked them all. There's a um, urban combat. But I mean, it, at the same time, there are some. There are. Um, there are other situations where it totally makes sense. You're both working for the same company, doing yeah. the same thing, like, and then yeah, you should be you're, making the same. Sorry, but to, if you're like a bagger, then you should be making the same money as a dude. Right. Like, and I can and no, I can honestly tell you there. that I know of some companies where it's actually the opposite, where um, the women are making more than the men, and the reason is yeah. not because of their sex. Because they're better. That's it right there. It's because they're better. And they they have you know their degrees are higher their um, uh, their knowledge base is better they they have more background so they're making more than the men are you know and it's like I've I've seen it both ways it's not always the case but I mean a lot of times it is mm -hmm. there's so many examples. Mm -hmm. There's examples both ways. That's the good thing about it because I'm not really saying it's good that there are examples both ways, but more for like your situation. If you're doing a, a, an essay, an argumentative essay. You need to have both sides. Oh shit. All right. What'd you forget? Um, oh fuck. Mini. Oh never mind. That wouldn't help at all. I can't even. The mini fight. Fight. Any uh. Let's see. It gives me, it gives me, you know, like, handlebars, an engine, and a wheel. Missed. Cannot believe it. I was just, I fired way too fast. Oh, how the fuck did I miss that one? Yeah, you're down. You're down. I thought I killed you. Oh, did not mean to pull the trigger. I 
just shot the freaking side of the building. I didn't think you had so it in you. Really? Good job. Well, okay then. Do we have an extra wrench? You look like you could handle your. Okay. Um, no, Be yeah. careful and try not to get yourself killed. Okay, I took a, a wrench. Okay. You hear that? Yeah. Alright, I gotta go drop some stuff off. I got too much stuff on me. Where's your Got your quest. Oh, no, I found Oh, she's gonna put some money up there. Hmm. Mm. Oh, I meant to sell her back that AK. Oh, well. Yeah, but, well, you can sell her back for now. Just give me a second. I'm trying to hit you. Okay, guys. Oh, there's a lot of people there. Yeah. There are definitely, um, police officers that I uh, don't like and um, cannot stand. And there are certain police stations that have officers that I have no interest in them being around. But I would never defund them, personally. Because as much as they piss me off and aggravate me and everything else, I still think that there's some validity to them being available to the general population. If that dog is outside, I'm going to be so upset. So what do you think, my friend? Should we can it and let you finish your, um... Uh, we can do one more quest. I need to eat something then. This, um... Tons of... Oh my god, no way. What? Oh. Did I share that question with you, by the way? Uh, you may have, yes. Um, with the bin. Hmm. Okay, give me one quick second. I'm going to... Um, The extra, mm, extra two things you get from it. I am on my way. I just needed to put something on me that helped me reload faster. Oh, was it the van thing? Yep. Yeah. Because, especially my pipe rifle. I need to find a new rifle, hunting rifle. Did you just start that quest? No, I didn't, yeah. Okay. I don't think I need my AK right now, so... Nah, I can just punch everybody. It says return to trader. Weird. Oh, uh, it's fine to bite rear supplies, so.
What's this quest supposed to be, anyways? We have to find uh, white river supplies. Can I not? Argus is dead, dude. He is now. He's dead Wicked too. Lag spike, bro. What is going on? Double tapping his ass. It says that I gotta go 300 meters. Am I not on your quest? What is going on here? Um, that's probably back to the trader, Michael. Oh. Are you on my quest? Does it say retrieve the supplies? Yeah. You but it says go. return to trader. Then you already did it. Oh, lockpicks. All right, well, what do you, did you get your supplies? Not yet. Pipes. Deep philosophical talk. Um, so what did you do? You went in and you just like grabbed everything and then threw it on the ground? Stuff I didn't want, yeah. I'll just carry it. I got nothing better to do. Somebody punching on the wall. What's up with that? Oh my god. It's annoying. What? It's a spot. This thing's bad. Person, this character sucks at riding a bike. <laughs> uh, did you crash? No. Just chilling. Yeah. I'm gonna go hang out with the trader for a minute. You left the hatch open. I don't think anything's gonna come inside our base. No, so either. Yeah, the dogs are outside. Why the fuck are the dogs outside? You're a good job. I knew you could do it. Well, that didn't take long. Iron pickaxe. Damn, nothing. Literally nothing I want. Iron pickaxe. Bandages. Molotovs. Two times a uh, scope. Ranged mods bundle. Thanks for the business. Mini bikes part parts bundle, farm bundle. You looking to if you finish two more jobs this week, I will give you employee Shit, of the month. Maybe next time I'll have what you need. Some. I have some. She's having me ask her for special jobs. What are you trying to lockpick? 
It's a no, no, no. It's a um, the digging thing. What do you mean? Do you have a quest or what? Yeah, it's a very surprise quest. Okay. So you need a lockpick. Yeah, you need to be able to lockpick it. Okay, well, I definitely got lockpicks. Alright. Let's go to the area then. Okay. I like how you just ran away and left me behind. That's great. Need something to drink. I'm underwater. <laughs> Towards the zombies, we'll get like spawned in when we get the stuff. Okay, what do you want me to do? One hits these, so so bad. I'm much better with a 9mm, holy crap. That's, that's sick. I'm hearing the noises, but I'm not seeing it. No, I mean the zombies. Yeah, this is a fucking lot of them. Oh my god. I had to go get this. I had to go get it now myself. Oh yeah, it's just in there. Did not know I was gonna have to go get it myself. Oh my god, they're fucking everywhere. I don't even know where my fucking bike is. Oh my god. Ah. Uh, got my bike. Me out. I had to fight to get my bike. <laughs> yeah, I'm not doing well. I'm um, I'm infected. I got a concussion. I'm thirsty. I'm hungry. And oh uh, my god! Yeah, and my health's down to forty-five. My character is a whiny bitch. I'm thirsty and driving through a river. Make that one make sense. Oh my god, I'm so pissed. 
Then I'll be able to basically get you out if you want. But it's almost 11, so. Mm hmm. Yeah, I'm just trying to get back there now. I'm 180 meters away. All right. 150. 120. 100. 80. 60. All right. 40. I, no. You got this, though. 23. We are here. Congratulations. Oh, I can make herbal antibiotics. Do you think I need those? Oh, I'm definitely getting the crystal. Oh, wow. Uh, nothing this time. Okay. What do you want to do here? Um, you got a thing that, why are you procrastinating? Um, I got to clear at 2.30. And I got to fetch at 2.24. Oh, this is the best way to get to. Okay, be careful and not try not to get yourself killed. I just need my levels. Oh, are you leaving so soon? I was hoping we could hang out a while. Just suffered a concussion. Did you get the uh, thing? Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's funny as hell. I hit your rear tire and I said I just sent it up doing a freaking wheelie. Oh, we just did this house. Oh, we get to do it again. Alright, there's like 15 zombies here. I'm gonna kill them all. Sounds good. You wanna kill the ones outside first? I'm doing it. I think I woke up the neighborhood. Got this one, Mike. Don't even worry about it. Okay. <laughs> I didn't? I got the one next to you, by the way. Oh. What the fuck? Bitch. I bomb. I go okay. Meters, charismatic miniature. Okay. Um, I apparently am not wearing glasses or something I used to wear before. I don't know. All of a sudden it says that my intellect is not as high as it should be for whatever I have. Oh, you must have had nerd glasses on. <laughs> Give me your intellect up by one. Yeah, but where the hell did they go? I don't know. They're pretty cheap from the trader. They can buy them. Oh, yeah. Oh, it could be due to a status. I got a concussion. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. That would make sense. That make you dumb. Two points for that. 
Um, right now, I am. Where am I at? Um, you are a strong motivational force nearby. Allies take 10% less damage from all sources. Take half damage uh, from bleeding and stop bleeding twice as fast. I'm assuming that stacked with the ones above it as well. I think so. Yeah, it does. It does. You are team leader and inspire those around you. Block and melee damage increase 20% from nearby allies. And then the other one you already know. All right, so it looks like you cleared it. I know what I'm gonna do for my essay, like what I'm gonna finish it up with. Mm -hmm. But it's just stupid in my opinion. I have to read it right now, so. That's the annoying part. I wanna be, that's the only thing I don't wanna do. Good job. If you're uh, feeling under the weather, I've got just what the doctor ordered. If you got There's the dupe, here's your pay for a job well done. Yeah, I already got a pistol. It was a level four. Well, I guess I'll grab the flashlight mod. Throw your flight of fibers at her. Yeah, stuff I don't need. Alrighty then. Stay safe out there. Alright. I say that we cut this out because it is getting late. And I am doing the yawning thing, which is not a good sign. So though we were a little late today, and I cannot, uh, now I'm having the same problem you had with your bike earlier. What? I had cotton in the way; I couldn't get on the bike. Oh. Oh, that's what my issue is. What? I didn't know that was what my, that was my issue. But... Yeah, I couldn't get onto it because the cotton was in the way. I didn't realize that. I was trying to go every which way around it; wouldn't let me do it until I got to the back of the bike, and then I said, "Okay, now you can get on." Okay, thank you. Alright, it's time for us to get off. It is. So we want to say thank you for joining us. And remember that Thursdays, usually, we're supposed to be in at the 7 o'clock hour. We were here late today. Um, like, notify, and subscribe so that way you know when we go live. You can catch us on our stream extras. Those can come at any time. There's no schedule for those. We just pop on because we just feel like it so um, you can catch us this game other zombie games survival games of various types um, but if you want to see a little bit of survival a little bit of wackiness hear some odd conversation or want to join in the conversation please feel free and uh, we will see you again soon so thank you for joining us in peace